Here comes another custom move which I tried with Android 7, 8, 9, 10 times and now it's back with Android 13 of course. We're talking about Bliss OS. Bliss OS was so popular in the previous times but after some time or maybe from previous some time this custom move was not up to the mark. But with this latest update if you install it and install kernel as you install launcher you will definitely love this thing if it is available officially for your device although this custom room is quite improved. We are talking about Bliss OS, which is Bliss Custom Room, which is of course based on Android 13 and it is having all the goodies what you need. But firstly, take a quick look at if you want to install Launcher on your device, you can install it very easily by uh, installing just a module. And in Bliss OS, of course, by default, we have that same Launcher called Launcher 3 available in most of the custom rooms. But in this case, if you install Bliss OS on your device, and install launcher on your device you will definitely love this thing after installing launcher no issues there the quick settings panel is actually having the dark mode even if you use a light mode but that's fine you can enable or disable the at a glance you have the option for home screen customizations icon pack which you can apply so that's a great combination bliss os with a custom launcher although the brightness slider is what you can see you can customize that very easily and all the useful tiles options are also present here so that's a great thing if you want to install bliss os on a device install launcher and the default experience might be improved in your case this is about the default launcher and the quick settings panel but if we move on to the other options the settings ui is in card style so if you're one of the users who actually want to see that how the settings look like the settings ui is card style ui but card style ui looks good Blissify includes all the customizations, battery etc has same kind of options, I mean we don't have to, we do not have to talk about much about these things. It also gives the facility to use face lock, fingerprint unlock and app lock and app lock is one of the features in a custom room which I think so approximately 90% of the users use because if you need that. Bliss updater is also included although I'm not sure if it supports OTA updates or not in my case. I do not use OTA updates much you saw that previously too. If I move on the customizations or theming options which are included in Bliss custom room it gives you some options related to theming we have some fonts customizations and fonts as expected there are many fonts available we have the option for icon pack we have the option for signal icons i mean to say in the terms of theming there are a lot of options available for you you can customize almost everything if you want to notifications and the retigger notifications which is the replacement of heads up notifications that's also present if you need retigger notifications it's there Retigger is actually one of my favorite features actually if I use custom room and if retigger notification options are present I will definitely use that. Miscellaneous etc have just same kind of things like we have the option to ignore the window secure flags which means you have the option to remove the restriction from that option called from the, from the apps where you can't take screenshots and screen record etc. How many options are there? We also have the kernel SU support, which means if you use Bliss options, if you use Bliss custom room, Bliss OS, then if you want to use kernel SU, you can use that. The safe net shall not be broken, so you will be able to use banking apps on advice. And in this case, I'm using two modules. Firstly, to customize the launcher, which is launcher what I'm using right now. And I'm also using MIUI Gallery China version. This module I have shared with you on my other channel too. If you want to take a look, you can simply check out the video there. I have this video available on my other channel regarding this Magisk module. This is MIUI Gallery and if I try to open MIUI Gallery, you can see MIUI Gallery is actually one of those galleries which is having good kind of features, good amount of editing features. The UI is too good too. If I check out here, you have the option for protective watermark, recognize text. All the MIUI 14 gallery features are present here. I do not have to editing. I do not have to install anything separately to use this. As you can see, protective watermark is working here too. So this is quite amazing. MIUI gallery is here. I can use custom launcher. By the way, this custom room also brings you different kind of dialer. I mean, this is not having the Google dialer pre-installed. If you use if you use this custom room, you will see that Octavi based dialer, which is having call recording enabled and some things like that. If you want to use editing, etc. Everything is so amazing. By the way, this is it 
about today's short and simple video this is bliss custom room if you want to install this custom room on your device if it is available officially or unofficially link is available in the description make sure to check out that these were the things i just wanted to let you know i hope you like this if you like this video and need some more videos regarding this one make sure to subscribe the channel also like this one and i will see you in the next one until then goodbye